Hi, I'm Wells President Mark Schrader. Asia Lutheran Seminary, which trains and equips Christians to serve Wells sister churches in Asia, has recently implemented a new program that strives to prepare even more men across the continent for gospel ministry. We travel to the Philippines to meet one of those men. Unique to Asia, the Philippines is a predominantly Christian country, mostly Roman Catholic. But in Davao City, we find Marzan, a lifelong Lutheran and a student of Asia Lutheran Seminary. He's had a desire to become a pastor since his elementary school days. I think the moment that I understood uh, what the gospel is and how uh, it is uh, for me, how it is to give me all that I need and everything that I need. Um, the moment that I realize and uh, see my pastor as this guy is not ordinary, <laughs> he's awesome, and I want to be like him. <laughs> I want to preach that message. However, Law and Gospel Lutheran Church, Wells' sister church in the Philippines, does not have an established seminary. Also, as a husband and father with responsibilities to his family, Relocating for theological education was not feasible for Marzan. I did uh, express my um, avail ex concerns about my availability, and um, they were so gracious enough to uh, find ways uh, to accommodate my, my situation. They just uh, presented to me that they have an online program for, for me. The online option offered to Marzan was made possible by Asia Lutheran Seminary based in Hong Kong working in conjunction with the local church in the Philippines. In addition to its in-person training of Christian leaders since 2005, Asia Lutheran Seminary has started an additional program called the Regional Theological Education Program. ALS's Regional Theological Education Program came about as a result of a, of a transition from ALS serving East Asia to now ALS uh, continuing to serve East Asia, but broadening its scope to serve as a regional seminary for all of Asia. This program now seeks to meet the needs of our partner churches around Asia. Working in more than a dozen Asian countries, such as Japan, Vietnam, Nepal, and the Philippines, ALS's Regional Theological Education Program assists well sister churches that need to train their pastors to serve Christ's people. Sometimes that training happens online, like in Marzan's case. Other times, it happens in person with a group of students. Sometimes, it's a combination of the two. Our regional theological education program was designed to be able to be more flexible. And so in some cases, we have these individuals um, where the, the church is small and they need some training. In other cases, there's a whole bunch of men that maybe are already serving in a congregation, but haven't had a lot of mm, Bible education, and so we're there to help them deepen their knowledge. Paul is making his way back to Jerusalem along with representatives from... In addition to studying the Old and New Testament, Lutheran doctrine, and understanding law and gospel, the Regional Theological Education Program works to train these Christian leaders for sharing the good news of Jesus within their particular context, which can look different from student to student, considering the wide variety of cultures within the continent of Asia. Are they serving as a pastor, as an evangelist? Are they um, working with a number of people or just on their own? Are they uh, living in a country which is persecuted, um, like Christians are persecuted? or are they living where they can uh, very openly and freely share the gospel? You know, so you pause there a little bit, right? You know, let, them, let that soak in. And that's also the wonderful thing about, you know, you could, you could ask the professor, Professor, how did you deal with this when you were uh, at this age? Or did you struggle as I've struggled? Struggle? And have you asked this question before? And most of the time, they have. 
We want leaders in all of our churches who are equipped and passionate about taking this message out to those in their own community, like Marzan, uh, taking it out to his neighbors and inviting them to come into his house to worship with them and to, to grow in God's word together uh, all across Asia. As Marzan works to complete his studies with Asia Lutheran Seminary, he has already gathered a group of Christians in his home for regular worship and Bible study. I'm excited even now, preaching and teaching in the gospel message. Uh, when we hear that uh, for the first time, that we are forgiven, there's something inside of us that we cannot explain, but uh, there's comfort and there's uh, security. And I want to uh, give that to other people too. Marzan's story of his desire to proclaim the gospel in his local area is not a unique one. All across Asia, there are confessional Lutherans who have that burning desire to share the good news of Jesus with their neighbors. And Asia Lutheran Seminary continues to find new ways to equip them to carry out that work. Please pray for these efforts and these students that they might be able to bring the message of grace to people all across the continent.